Hey, Baron. How you doing? Good. How are you? All right. Hey, I uh, was interested in kind of your progression uh, as a true freshman and in the spring and then where you're at now. Yeah, it's, it's been a big change from going from uh, 3A ball to this college out here. And so it, it's been a good change. I think I've learned a lot over the last year. Uh, my body's starting to mature, starting to gain a little bit more weight. Um, so it's been really fun. Um, all the players on the team, you know, we're, we're really starting to come together as one. And that's been a little bit different. And, you know, it's really cool to see all of us come together as one. How would you describe uh, Coach Kidley's offense? God, Coach Kidley's offense is fast. Um, it's physical. We're tough. Uh, we like to throw the ball around, and that's perfect for, for this team out here. And so I think it's really cool to um, play in that offense because it's very unique. It's not something that you see um, just in a regular college offense. And so it's really fun to play for. What's something that maybe you bring to the quarterback position that perhaps Donovan or uh, Tyler didn't bring? Yeah, I think we all bring a unique uh, asset to the game. Um, I feel like I bring more of a um, create big plays, create uh, extra yardage plays. Um, and I think we all do a good job of that. I think that Tyler, he's very, very smart in the classroom. He understands ins and outs of all the football. And Donovan's just a run you over kind of guy, and he can sling it too. So I think we all bring a really cool asset to the, to the table. As a fan just hey, Donovan, what is it like with your dad having gone to the Giants now, not being here? Is it any different at all for you? No, not really different. Just uh, I practice. You know, he's not in my ear all the time. I have Sir Roger and the running backs. If I ever, if I ever need some, some motivation like that, he'll do. They'll, they'll yell at, yell, they'll yell at me uh, in his place. So, uh, no, nothing big really changed. Um, Cause I, I talk to him every day. So, no, nothing too crazy. Just get, not getting yelled at as much. What is he trying to tell you in terms of like you know helping you do your thing here and with the quarterback competition going on? Yeah, he's just been telling me make sure you compete, uh, make sure you be disciplined, and make sure you be detailed with everything you do. So I've just been taking what he said, what he's learned, um, being with the New York Giants and everything like that. So I, I take what he tells me and try to apply here. What's something that you bring to the quarterback position that perhaps Barron or Tyler doesn't? Um, I think we all bring. Um, I think we all bring any qualities that you need to in a room. You know, um, I just feel like we're all great leaders. We're all we all bring energy at all times. Coach Kidley always tells us, you know. We, and the offense runs through us, so we pick each other up when we need to. We bring energy when somebody's down, and we, we just lead the team um, uh, when when the team needs to be led. Speaking of Coach Kitley, how would you describe his offense? Uh, air raid, attack all day long. We're gonna pass the ball deep, short, whatever you need. If you if we see a coverage that you know we don't like, and you try to take something away, we got something else for it. Um, if you if, if you want to cover the pass game, we got the run game at all times. So it's it's really a versatile offense, air raid offense. You want to attack. What have you worked on the most since last year? Uh, biggest thing was um, taking care of the ball, decision making, and uh, my footwork as well. Thanks. What have you really seen through the defense, uh, improvements on the defensive side? During mm -hmm. that? I really feel like they're playing free. You know, they've done a great job of disguising. You know, they play with a you know they play with a certain level of edge as well. You know, we come out to practice, compete with each other. We're talking crap, and I think that's the best part. Was we're we, we're on that fiery edge of you know who's going to win this practice, who's going to get this rep, who's going to win this period. Um, and they've done a great job because Coach Ruder, you know, he, he has a lot of plays, a lot of checks for them, but they can just play free, play what they see. Um, they're trying to get tendencies of ours. You know, I know what they're doing. They know what we're, they know what we're doing sometimes because we go against each other so much. So that's been the funnest part is, you know, they got so much talent and, um, on the back end and, you know, in the linebacker crew and up front now. So um, I think they're really ready to go. Hey, Tyler, you've been in a couple offenses now. How would you describe Coach Kitley's offense? I mean, I think it's just the – it's just next level with the ability of you know how how much he gives us on the field with uh, our control and our ability to play what we see as far as what the defense is doing and how we can attack it. You know, a lot of times I've been in certain situations where you know you see a certain look or see a certain front where you're not comfortable going against it with this play. You know, maybe not, maybe you don't have the tools to attack it. So he does a great job of uh, giving us the keys to it. Um, he's really um, and he really gets on us if we don't check out of a play. We're in a bad certain situation. Um, and he also has a, the smartest mind that we're gonna. He's gonna put us in the right play, you know. Hopefully, regardless. But he does a great job coaching. So. Just ask Baron a little bit about that before too. Mm -hmm. um, obviously, the quarterback is the primary focus of an offense. But for lack of a better word, is this the most quarterback centric offense that you've been a part of? Yeah, I think so. I mean, I think um, as far as you know, what it flows through, the signals, the, the cadences, stuff like that. Um, to where it's all centered through us. It's all based on our memorization, our control. You know, in other offenses, they have a wide receiver signal, a quarterback signal, or a O line signal. Or so um, there's different philosophies, but I really enjoyed this one because, you know, there's no miscommunication because we're telling them what to do. Um, we have the full control of it. Uh, 
Uh, how <clears throat> quickly were you guys able to kind of get a little bit more comfortable with the schemes that he's running? I mean, I, it was tough at first with the, the complexity of the signals, the complexity of the plays, but I'm, I'm, for me, you know, I, that's kind of been my bread and butter so far this offseason is really diving into that and talking to the wide receivers and the line and meeting with the coaches, you know, day in and day out to really master it because I know that's what's going to give me the edge and give me that comfortability on the field. What makes this so complex compared to other offenses? Uh, <coughs> Excuse me. Um, I think it's just been the multitude of signals, um, the multitude of, you know, different versions of plays, um, you know, how fast Coach Kidley does it sometimes, you know, the ability that we have to take what he signals and put it on the field as far as what side, what play goes to which, stuff like that to where, you know, sometimes for a younger guy coming in or even for certain um, wide receivers, sometimes it can be pretty complex, but I really kind of take that on as a challenge. What gives you the advantage in this battle? I really think, you know, what we were just talking about is my understanding of the game and the defenses and, um, and also the playbook as well. You know, I feel like I've, you know, I've seen a lot of football and also my relationship with the guys and the, the hours we spent, you know, in the offseason working together. Um, I really have that, you know, a certain level of confidence to where I'm going to go in. No matter who using the quarterback competition, no matter who we're playing, that, you know, I'm going to get the job done. And I'm the best guy for the team. So I've kind of taken that, you know, through each mistake, through each success, and I'm taking it to the end.